<sighs> it's Wednesday. It's um, it is. We're not having any fish today. There will be no fish. There will be minimal fish content tonight. And I have made sure of this. No one can hear you yet. So haha. -ha. And so your so your fish pun was wasted. Um, so there will be minimal fish content. Tonight I am focusing on having my milk. Also, I took the, th the the stream back down to 30 frames a second for tonight. I don't know if it's like something with the build of Windows that I'm on on my machine, because of course I'm beta testing and streaming off the same machine. Why wouldn't I? Um, but we're going to try this and see if things go slightly less sideways tonight. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Camera still works great. We got fancy lights. So, actually, let's let's cool it down a little bit. There we go. <sighs> so nice, so nice. Um, there there will be no sadness about the fish. I said minimal fish content. There may be some fish content, but not the the horse shit that we went through or that I went through on Monday. We're not doing that shit again. Ah, uh, but. Um, yeah. Helena's here. Lollipop will be back momentarily because, um, pup stuff. Because, you know, pup. I'm here. Oh, are you? Are you back? Okay. He's done with his pup stuff. Okay. Lollipop's done with his pup stuff. He's right there. It's fine. It's fine. Um, uh, so, yeah. Um, you want to play some video games? Let's play some video. Let's play some video games. <sighs> Vidya. Vidya. The Vidya games. Hmm. <laughs> Warning. Some fish content. It's mostly just going to be fishy puns. <laughs> Warning. This stream may contain really fish content. Content. Viewer discretion is advised. Oh God, Minecraft never, never do that. What did Minecraft do? It snapped to my side monitor. Ooh. And guess what? It sleepy sleeps. Come on, you're you're coming to bed with me. You haven't come to bed with me in weeks. Come on, buddy. Oh, I'm still digesting all that fish. The purpurs. What a good boy with the purpurs. He's a good purpur kitty. <laughs> he bringed in me a feather. What a good boy. What a good boy to Kidarino. Are you hungry? Do you want to eat some fish that's on the wall? Yes, you do. You want to eat some wall fish? You sure do. <laughs> One fish, two fish, three fish. <laughs> That's the true justice for Kitterino. Four fish, fish, fuck fish, you fish. <laughs> what a good boy. I don't know who's generating the fish content now. I have just destroyed the fish content. The fish content is gone. You know, every good bedroom needs a clock. By the way, um, so we have some stuff to talk about tonight. First of all, the shulker that used to live up here above this one dump chest is gone. That shulker that I had on loan from Mo because she wasn't using it is now back in the Mo box so she can use it. Also, this is, aside from this stuff, empty. Aside from the stuff that I literally just put in that there. That you literally just put in it. So that stuff is gone. We'll talk about that in a moment. There we go. Clock. Bedroom clock. Okay. In the meantime, folks, the Sortomatic has been turned back on. Bay 1 is complete. So we have all of our stones and stone like variants here, including our andesite, diorite, and granite cobble and mossy cobble 
Then we got like stone bricks, chiseled. We got clay and like brick bricks, terracotta and gravel, sand and sandstone variants, dirt and snow and ice. Then we got our nether stuff. All through here, we got our end stones and bricks. We got our underwater stuff here. Stupid question. Sure. Where's warp stem? Warp stem? Well, I'm so glad you asked. It's right over here. Down here. Oh, okay. So I keep looking where the, the mushrooms are and getting confused because I'm easily confuzzled. No, that's okay. I'll I'll explain that part in a minute. So we've got our underwater stuff here, including sea lanterns, or sea pickles, I'm sorry. Sea lanterns are up there. Sea pickles, which are adjacent to all of the lighting stuff. So things like sea lanterns, glowstone and glowstone dust, shroom lights, torches of both kinds, lanterns of both kinds, end rods, and jack-o'-lanterns, because I thought it would be fun. Uh, let's see. And then we get into wood. The, the last... Four sections down here, two on the left and two on the right, are all wood and wood style stuff. So we have of the four or the six different kinds of woods, they're logs, the stripped logs, the wood that's the bark on all six sides, the stripped wood, which is the stripped on all six sides, and planks. So this is includes the stuff that we accidentally make when we mean to make planks, but also planks. So we have that for spruce, birch, oak, dark oak, acacia, and jungle. And then, because they're basically wood, both crimson and warp stems. They're not exactly wood, but they're wood adjacent. Both figuratively and literally now. Um, then we got all the saplings and seeds. Then we got some, uh, uh, then we got our produce section here. Sugar cane and sugar cane products, leather and rabbit hides, minimal fish content, rabbit feet, cooked meats and taters and dried kelps and bread. Then we've got all the, the fungal stuff here, including nether wart, nether sprouts, dead bushes, coarse flowers and coarse fruit. Then we've got all our crimson nylium fungus, weeping vines, crimson roots, nether warp blocks. Same for like the warped and twisting variants, blah, blah, blah. Then we come down, we got our iron and gold, obsidian, crying obsidian, diamonds, emeralds. And then like our, our super useful stuff. So like the coal blocks, redstone, lapis, flint and quartz, sticks and bamboo. What's nice is because this bamboo is on top, it means it'll get sorted earlier into the system. So when we start the uh, bamboo farm up top, that stuff will go right in here. So it'll be great. Um, so then we go to bay two. Uh, Elena, did you run away already? Yeah, my shulker box and uh, end chest is over at somewhere. The boat. Yeah, why? Do you need me? I was going to give you a, a quick tour of some things that I think might be of interest to you. I mean, I'm watching your stream. Well, that's fair. Okay. So, <laughs> coming into Bay 2 now, which is also complete, we start on our mob loot stuff. So, we got bone meal, bones, and bone blocks. So, again, bone and bone accessories. Strings, feathers, shells, spider eyes, eggs, ink sacks, and rotten flesh. Slime blocks and slime balls, blaze rods and blaze powder, magma cream, magma blocks, fire charges, gas tears, ender pearls, and wither skeleton skulls. Then we have all of our flowers. Then we have some of our overworld uh, greenery like vines, grass, ferns, and our pokey boys up top. So again, when the cactus farm does its thing, and because it is fully automated and just slowly gives us cactus, which we have a shit ton of now, which is amazing... Uh, it'll just filter in here very quickly because it'll go because top stuff gets f uh, filed f away first. Then, then Elena, we do colors. Colors. For each color, we have the dye, concrete powder and concrete blocks, stained glass and stained glass panes, terracotta and glazed terracotta, wool, carpet, and banners, and we have them, folks. 
all, and I mean all 16 colors, sorted and ready to roll. We have white, black, gray, light gray, red, orange, yellow, lime, green, cyan, blue, light blue, purple, magenta, pink, and brown. All sorted, all ready to go. That's it. We're done with this. It's all done. All the color stuff is done. <sighs> Colors. And I started moving things around in Bay 3. So I moved some, th I had to condense down because I did pull a bunch of stuff out. Even though I did move some things or add a bunch of new things to the Sortomatic. So there's still some things that I have to put back in. And you can see, like, I've got all of the coral stuff in here. Plus gunpowder, which I'm not quite done with that yet, because that's in a section that I haven't gotten started on yet. But I'm still pushing for quartz adjacent to become a thing. Are you? Yeah. And by pushing, I mean gently suggesting occasionally. Are you? Ooh. Are you? My friend, these are sorted. These are sorted and active. Yay! So there's not much of any of them right now because I made just enough to make the sorting mechanism work. I mean, that's fine. But... They are there, just above the rails and Mr. Bucket. Yay! So Quartz is in here, and we're all good now. Nice! Um, and then some of the other I stuff, like plain glass, glass panes, bottles, ladders, scaffolding, chains, arrows, iron bars, bowls, and leads are all here. So this is all sorted. So the only things that we had in before that are not currently sorted automatically are gunpowder, name tags, and the coral blocks, which I will get to um, eventually. But I'm not really worried about it right now. That stuff is stuff that we use either sparsely or not at all. Like, we're not brewing potions right now. We're not making firework rockets. We're not doing any of that kind of stuff. We'll, we'll burn those bridges when we get to it. I will happily make potions if we need them. I, I enjoy doing that shit. But but we don't need them right now. Correct. So all of that stuff is done. Bays 1 and 2 and the first two sections of Bay 3, they're done. They're just done. Um, I will eventually go through and start clearing out behind Bay 3 to extend it out to the full 10-section um, length that the other two bays are now. But I don't really care. Um I have noticed now that because of the way that the Sortomatic is built with the extended bays, um, it does run faster because I don't have to run back and forth so much to make sure chunks are active. So as long as you are somewhere in the Sortomatic in bays one or, to one or two, the entire Sortomatic is loaded. Which means the whole sorting mechanism will run while you're inside the Sortomatic. Um, I am considering moving off of Realms onto a privately hosted server. It will be a pain in the ass to get me on there because I'm on console. It's so much easier to do it on PC because you can actually add servers. Uh, console, you can't just add them. You have to go through like this thing of fucking it up and then tricking it into giving you the dialogue to um, to add a server, but we'll get there eventually. And yes, not just arrows. Arrowed! It's my throwback to early 2000s internet. Back in the Homestar Runner days. Uh, meow. What a good boy. Um, oh, that reminds me. I was supposed to hear from the uh, the artist today on the the emotes. She might. I don't. I don't know. I don't think she got them, or she's supposed to have them done. Is 
So I might have those. Hopefully we'll have those on Friday. Like all ready to go and everything. Thinking about putting, uh, just to be very meta, putting both item frames and chests into the sword matic I feel like that's necessary. That would be very meta. And, and like barrels? And oh and barrels. Hard. Yeah, barrels will go in there too. And all of the and all of the redstone components? All the redstone components, yep. All those two. Awesome. Cause then we don't have to we could like when we're bored we could pre make a bunch and then we don't have to go making eighteen billion redstone torches. We could just pull some out of them. And we could just pull some out. Uh, and now I will say this though, um, Elena, that might mean that you need to be back on your your old bullshit. <laughs> uh, uh, and Elena's like, Elena's like, oh no, don't make me mole. Like, oh no, giving me a purpose. Whatever will I do? I'm listen. I'm just I'm just really proud of all the stuff that we have. Like, I think. Probably my favorite thing right now is the the cactus farm, like that, like me and Lollipop agonized over. <laughs> it was a lot of. Uh, you should figure out how to do this before I figure out how to do this. And then you were like, "Fine, fine, twist my arm, fine." Other Sydney, oh my God, other Sydney's here. Hi, other Sydney. Welcome in. I also stay on my bullshit, so don't feel bad. So, other Sydney used to be Sydney's roommate. Um, and. Sydney-ception. Huh? Sydneyception? Sydneyception. Hello, and thank you. Or what? Eh, we'll talk about it later. Huh? Huh? I'm so confused. I haven't told y'all yet. Told me what? I'll tell you Tell's later. When older. I'll tell you when you're older. Okay, but I'm older now. Yes. I will tell you not on stream. Okay. Okay. Wait, when is she coming to visit? Other Sydney, when are you coming to visit? And when are you going to come hang out? Also, be safe. Wait, are you actually here? Are you here here? That's a past tense, came. That means that means you are here. Like actually here here. Like physically here. Oh, mayor. Okay, okay. Is that a that is a trap chest, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, okay. All right. So, all right, Mayor June. Mayor June's not bad though. Um, I need. Kind of want to fill this in a little bit. All right, time to visit Tree Abyssia. Before I go mo before I go to the TVs, before I go moling. Because we don't have any stack of any individual wood. Okay, okay, you bullied her to visit the stream, but she's going to come visit us physically... Willingly. Okay. All right. That's fair. Well, thank you, Sydney, for bullying her to come watch. Don't bully her. Just give her gentle nudges. Like, hey, hey, just like, hey, hey, hey. Once in a while, certain it. personalities need to be bullied into things that are good for them. Well, that's true. That's true. And other Sydney is is one of those personalities. She does. She does need encouragement. I really. I, why is this? Why did this generate like this? This is. This is. This is too perfectly weird, and I don't like it. We're we're filling it in. That's it. I'm filling it in. This would be probably a lot faster if I went and got my spoon. I 
All right, I was still supposed to redo this bridge. Yeah, I was supposed to redo it too. Fencing won't work if there are lower slabs. Wait, what won't work? I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, eventually I'll redo it. I should put mending on my axe. Oh yeah. Hey man, I got shears with mending on them, so like, you know, whatever. I don't, I don't shear things nearly enough for that, but you know. Listen, Sydney, that's what you got to do. You know, like, be like, you know, just, just like, really, just in passing, be like, hmm, wow, you're not watching, you're not watching the stream. It's like, wow. I mean, like, that's, I guess that's your choice and all, but like, wow, really, that's, that's your choice is to not watch the stream, like, hmm. 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 Bold choice. Not one I'd make, but, you know, bold choice nonetheless. All right, let's see. Yeah, I'm. I really am considering um, moving off of Realms onto a private server because I would really like to have the increased um, simulation distance. Like, even if it's not sixteen chunks, like twelve would be nice. Because even at twelve chunks, that would be enough for us to load. Um, a lot of the, the farm stuff while we're at home or close to home. <laughs> I mean, damn, Sydney, like, it's true though. Us Capricorns, we got to stick together. But only in groups of two at a time. Only in groups of two at a time. That's right. Oh my God. Did we have, did we have that discussion on stream? Yes. Okay. Okay. I just want to make sure. I mean that's it's a it's it's a fairly widely known fact, but but also, you know, like, I've never heard of it, so I learned a thing. Yeah, no, we're Capricorns are pretty strong personalities, and also, like, if you find two that get along, like, well, that's really good, and also, that's it. That's your limit. That's your you 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 got to get cut off after that. Aw, thank you, other Sydney. I don't know what to say other than other Sydney. We've been having, we've been trying to figure this out for like forever now. Like there's Sydney, and then there's other Sydney, and that's that's it. That's 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 all we know. That's 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 all we know how to do. Like we've we've tried we've tried saying Sydney Reeves, and it's like which one Sydney Reeves? Oh, other Sydney. Because we know there's Sydney, then there's other Sydney, but like, is Sydney Reeves like a third Sydney? It's like, no, no, that's, that's, that's just other Sydney. And then it just comes back around. Look at all this weird pods all over here. I swear to God, I think I hear a lawnmower outside at 8 o'clock at night. I mean, it's Florida, so sure. Like, get your yard work done when it's not like 100 degrees out, but also, what the shit. Oh. Better 8 o'clock at night than 8 a.m. That's very true. On the weekend. Oh. From young, young Sydney to Asian Sydney. Well, I don't want to go there. Because then it's like, well, what if there's another Asian Sydney? I, I don't know. There could be. I guess then you'd be like other Asian Sydney. Then you'd, you'd be other Sydney, and then they'd be other Asian Sydney. That's, that's also well, true. To, the more Sydneys you know, you're going to have to start adding more and more qualifiers to them. 
That's, I just want you to know yeah. I have never had this problem in my life. So I don't really know how to solve this kind of problem. What, like having multiple Sydneys? No, having multiple of my name. Oh, there oh, of your own name. Elon. There has never been another Elon. Yeah, I well... I have never had to figure out what to do and who's Elon and who's other Elon. So let me tell you a fun story. So, uh, growing up in my hometown, it's a fairly small town. Um, so, you know, we didn't have too many people that we didn't know, especially me, because of course not. Why would I have anybody that I don't know? Um, but in our high school, I, uh, there were, there were other Zachs. But then there was a Zach Williams. And that got confusing a couple of times, especially around the subject of like detentions and shit like that. Because I had people like come ask me about like, you know, go going to detention and shit. And I'm like, no, that's not me. That's the other one. He's a year younger than me. Go, go bother him. And it also didn't hurt that I knew most of the faculty on a first-name basis at my high school. You know, because, again, of course, why wouldn't I? And also, unrelated to this story, there is a goddamn llama on top of the fucking barn now. So that's a thing. It wasn't me. I know it wasn't you. Actually, I think it was inadvertently me. I think that a wandering trader spawned up there and the llama just is the only thing left of it. Oh, that reminds me. I gotta get spruce. So, in our neighborhood, we don't necessarily... By the way, we, we don't need a lawnmower in our neighborhood, but the adjacent neighborhoods do. So, it's probably one from an adjacent neighborhood where they don't have, like, our stuff. Because all around us are just, like, regular single-family homes. Not like the townhouses we live in. You are, you are not the llama queen. We do have, like, a... A thousand fucking llamas on this server, though. Like, no lie. They're everywhere. They're just everywhere. Like, I'm not kidding. They are everywhere. We have we have a hole in the floor, and there's the llama irregardless. Fucking llama. That's Tom's handiwork. Oh, now I feel really bad. Be a llama. Lollipop understood that reference. Lollipop is being a lumberjack over here. Well, if he's a lumberjack, he's okay. If he, yep. As long as he sleeps all night and he works all day. I mean, you'd know more about the working part than I would. It's true. He does do work. <laughs> occasionally. Yeah. Yeah, I totally opened up a whole bunch of support tickets today. That's what I did. It's true, you did. I mean, listen, that's work. Oh, you want to know something else that was weird? So I was hanging out in the barn today, trying to get the, the sheep to, to generate wool. And, like, I came outside at one point, and there was, like, one of the one of the illagers, one of the, the illagers was, like, the one with the, what's the one with the crossbow? Anyway, he was. A uh, illager with a crossbow? Is that is it just an illager with a crossbow? Like he doesn't have a special name or anything. All right, that's fair. But yeah, he was he was just chilling up on the roof up here. Like, buh? Where did he even come from? What does he do? I don't know. Who who can say? Who? Uh. Oh, hold it, hold it, hold it. Me? No. Oh. Us. There are problems in here. Uh oh. Um. Don't know how I managed that one, but fixing. Well, no, you're gonna have to come in here. Well, I I have things to fix out here too, so. Oh, because okay. other Sydney, because we're not because we're not that smart. 
I'm not that smart. Let me rephrase. I'm not that smart. Look at the Temple of Time. I love it so much. I love everything about this. Should it, be good to go again. It's just beautiful. <sighs> I somehow managed to hit redstone out here. Oh no. That's not ideal. No. That's why I'm letting it grow out slightly before I go to it. Let me see something. Oh. You know, I'm kind of at a loss for what to do. I've been working on, like, the Sortomatic has been my life for, like, a month plus, And I'm taking a break from it. Well, you said you needed spruce, so that's, that's occurring right now. Oh, I got the spruce that I needed. I just needed a few pieces. We had some. Oh, well. You're getting restocked on spruce. That that works for me. I'm I'm I ain't mad at it. Could always start expanding the sheep farm. That's true. Yes, you did, because it is a very efficient form of food. Listen, I just, it's not that it's an efficient form of food. It's not terribly efficient in Minecraft. We just have fucking a thousand of them. We don't have a thousand. Um, well, yeah, actually, we probably do. Said we probably okay, won't okay, hold on. No, yeah. I'm going to run the numbers. Nope, I'm running the numbers. It's too late. So let's see how much a double chest of fish would we be. We do have over a thousand, but so, we don't have a double chest of cooked. Well, then let him let him do his numbers. All right, okay. Okay. Um, so there are sixty-four to a stack. Double chests are nine stacks wide by six stacks high. So if we move this down here and move it up there. Um, this is 3,456 cooked cod. Then That's we fair. then we come up here, and this is roughly another 1,000. So we're close to the neighborhood of 4,500 cooked cod. So yes, we have literally over 1,000 fish. And that's, that's, that's just the cooked cod. That doesn't account. For the raw cod that we have over here as well. Which we have nearly the same amount. I could get you more fish if you wanted. I said there would be minimal fish content on this stream and I meant it. I mean he's going to end up with more fish anyway because um, one of the things Tom was saying is that he wanted him to build a layer of Trader Tom's out of Prismarine so... That's true. I wonder what color prismarine. Um, knowing Tom, probably he'll probably end up doing dark. But I don't know. We'll find out. I'm sure. All right, there are dolphins out here. I was gonna feed a dolphin a fish, and see if we can find some treasure. We find some treasure. Wait, is that a thing? Yeah, if you feed a dolphin fish, it'll it'll like guide you to the nearest buried treasure. Yeah, this is... Oh, shit. I just noticed there was a crazy break. Son of a... Okay. All right. All right, Sydney. I've got to get a basket for these. All right. Here are your choices tonight. We have the original. We have milk chocolate. 
we have Greek yogurt covered, and we have the trail mix. Which one would you like? Or dealer's choice. That reminds me, I gotta get more, I gotta get more cherry, cause I, oh god, those are my favorite. And I'm out of them and it makes me sad. And we tried to order some the other day and they were out at the store. At the Crazen store. Also known as Le Target. Where's, I can't even... I feel like no response has to be dealer's choice. Um, yeah, that's that's kind of what I'm I'm leaning toward too. Oh, the yogurt, the yogurt. Okay, all right. Yogurt. All right. All right. Greek yogurt it is. Yeah, cherry really does. Oh, cherries. Like the, the cherry juice infused craisins. Oh, the pomegranate ones are good, too. They're a little more tart. Uh, all right, Sydney, just for you. Greek yogurt, cranberry bites. Hmm. And read the little spiel on the back. Satisfy your sweet tooth. The delicious, sweet, and chewy dried cranberry you love, covered in real tangy Greek yogurt for a wholesome snack you can feel good about. Hmm. Sydney, are you watching on um, on console or on your computer on your phone? Because you can check, there's, I know on the computer, if you hover over the the stream and go to settings, you can turn on the low latency so it, it catches up faster. I think mobile does it as well. Where is this low settings? Mm-hmm. Okay, I do have it on. For all that stream watching, I do. For all that stream participating in that you do also. All right, I something like that. I think I, I think we're good. Unless you want more wood, Chris, or is this for you too? I'm take. I'm taking some of this. Oh, okay. Then let me keep going. I don't. I'll, I'm. I'm good. If you're done. I will go until you say done. Oh, you're in Waldo. That's right. You're out of town this week. Boo, boo, Waldo. For those who are unfamiliar, Waldo is an incredibly small town in Florida that if you blink, you will miss it. And it is also a very infamous speed trap. So if you don't slow your ass down, the uh, local police there will not miss you. You'll blink and be pulled over? Yeah, pretty much. We had one of those in Ohio. It was annoying mm. as crap. Mm-hmm. Well, there's a motocross pit behind your hotel. Well, I mean, there's there's the entire motocross like um, track here. That well, it's kind of messed up right now. Well, you know, it is what it is. We're good if you want to be done. Either. Okay. I just need a full stack of something, and that's all I came here for. I feel like I I managed that. Oh, it's getting late, isn't it? Oh, poops. I guess I should better head back to the house for a uh, sleepies. Wait a minute. I don't have to head back to the house. There's only two beds here, and all three of us are here. Well, you say that. Nope, that's not the one I wanted. I I brought my own bed. Oh well, then I will, I will be the bear in the middle. <laughs> you sleep <laughs> with your. 
sleep, sleep in, in your bed in hand. Bed, but also have your own bed in hand. That's right. Uh, you know, I'll just I'll just take this with me in case I'm gone for a while. Let's go swimming. Do, do, do. do you need me to gather the wood, or are you bringing it back, Chris? I'll take care of bringing it back. Okay. I think Don't I'm... let me squids you see while you're under there. Oh. We're going to need infinite in ink sacks for Dark Prismarine again. Do you need Dark Prismarine, or are we just assuming that Tom's going to build Dark Prismarine? I am going to extend the, uh, the pathway on the other side as big as it is now, so I will need Dark Prismarine, and I'm assuming that Tom's going to want Dark Prismarine. Well, all right. Let me tear this, this sunken boat apart first. I'm going to assume that at, he's at least going to want both, because the both together is a nice aesthetic. It really is. And it prevents it from being super sameness of one or the other. Yeah, it, it kind of cuts through the monotony, which is really nice. Always carry your own bed. It's true. You never know when you're going to need to take a nap. Oh, hey. And if you're really smart, you'll have a towel, too. Oh, God. That's also true. Hmm. You know, I should probably I also just... a lot of just... things to do today. I took a nap. <laughs> was it a very good nap? It was a very good nap. Good. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Um, I'm going to go back home for a minute. But... Wait, Sydney, you can't swim? Like, can you not swim? It will... How come you can't swim? Did you just never learn how? I will help you. If that's it, I will help you. I love when the dolphins swim with you because you get the extra speed boost. Noom. Noom. You can survive. Well, I mean, survival's good. Survival's good. Um, I'm taking... Oh, man. I will teach you. I am... I am... Uh, I am buoyant, so... I can also do that. Uh, let's see. What do I need? Oh... Oh, I need And see if I can figure out how to brew a potion of water breathing. If it'll load. We'll see how it goes. A grown man. We still man's... have some over by the TVs, don't we? Do we? Yeah, I think we do. And I'm, I'm heading over there. I'll check. Okay. Kind of let you know. Uh, I might just come with you. Just because I'm... What the heck? Let's go through the uh, the old the old Nether Reno here. Sydney, would you let me teach you how to swim? Oh heck, I forgot I got this place looking sharp. Wait, which place? The TVs? Mm-hmm. Bunch of random. I need to clean up, up the TVs and bring stuff back now that you've got colors and things sorted. Yeah, you can you can bring you can bring that kind of stuff yeah, back. Yeah, there's a whole 
nine nine water breathing potions over here. All right, I think I'm gonna come grab like four of them. Yeah, cause I'm I'm kind of there feeling the swimmies. I kind of got to figure out a direction too, cause maybe I should head toward a direction where I can get home easily. I don't know. I feel like that's probably a smart idea. But then, when have I ever done Grab anything smart me. around here? You fish up the puffer fish that make them. Oh yeah, you use puffer fish for that, don't you? Because they puff up. Uh, a lot of times. Yep. Wait, was that the was that the other thing that we needed the nether wart for? You're cutting out. Just FYI. There, how's that? Is that better? I mean, so far so good, but it's difficult to tell with cutting out because intermittent is intermittent. That's fair. All right, let's see. Come back here. And back over here. Uh, yeah, let's let's just go for a while. Ice bear good. More ice bear. More good. <gasps> Other oh, Sydney, thank you for the follow. You have a lot of stuff over here. Yes. Oh. That, the stuff in that room is useful, but the stuff in um, the front room, the random diorite and random glazed terracotta is not useful. Other than the diorite, but the rest of it is not useful. Maybe I could swim home from here. Probably. Or at least swim and walk and swim. Mmm. Swimmy swims. Let's do That's the swimmy swims. Swim. <sighs> Aw, thanks, other Sydney. That's a chicken, and that's a baby chicken. They look dumb, and I love them. A FaceTime from your cat. Oh, I love your cat. Oh, the mini is such a good kitty. She's such a sweet baby. Hello, random llama. Anyone who looks as cute as Elliot has to be a good cat. She's, she's a... She, well... She's and good she in her. She's good in her own way. Well, yes, like Elliot is good where he doesn't believe in doors. Well, listen, he's doing his best. He's trying. His loudest. I said what I said. You mean, his, you mean his loudest? He's a good kitty. He just wants cheese and to be able to, you know, walk between rooms. He's unencumbered. Pain in the butt when I'm not here. That's because he knows you're the cheese bringer. Something like that. I'm the sucker. Ooh, what do we have here? Not that we need any more, but should I get these pumpkins? No, I shouldn't get these pumpkins. Yes. We Let's get the pumpkins. We have pumpkins. There are never enough pumpkins. Oh, that's that's a fair point. Minnie doesn't believe pumpkins in no. Emerald. She, taught, she called to tell me that Andrew did clean her litter box. Well, good job, Andrew, for cleaning the litter box. Well done. Okay. 
Okay, this is the direction of home. Elliot under well, Elliot sort of understands no, but when it comes to doors, he doesn't believe that your no is correct. Wait, Cornelia, who's Cornelia? The Andrews here too. We got the whole gang. What's up, buddy? Did so so did Minnie lie? Did you actually not clean her litter box? Or is this a plot to get you to clean your litter box to make Minnie not be a liar? Oh, I see. I see. So really what happened was Sydney was just kind of putting it out into the universe and that hoping that if she did that Andrew would do it. I mean, this her is this is a fair Cornug! Okay, alright, so other Sydney, here's what you need to do. You need to join the Discord, and you there's a critters channel on the Discord where all of the other critters get posted, like pictures of Minnie and Elliot and Liara. Elliot and Liara are Lollipop and Elena's kitties. And Elliot is the one that looks a lot like Minnie. And also begs for cheese quite frequently. Liara is finally coming back in favor, but that is tentative and remains to be seen. She's doing her best. It's not. It's not really her fault. She's. She's. She's doing her best. Something like that. Yes, he is a boy kitty, and he is the very fluffy. He's a very fluffy boy, and we love him. We will give him the cheese or the breakfasts or whatever he desires for he is a good boy and he just deserves to be happy. He discovered he liked a bit of my quesadilla the other day. Ooh, quesadilla. Because it contains cheese, so, you know. It does, in fact, contain cheese. I'm a big fan of quesadillas because of their cheese content and their ability to use cheese as a glue to hold in other things, mostly meat. Accurate. I just picked up an experience orb. There is an experience orb out here, so I have no idea what who killed what when. But that's a that's hilarious to me. It was probably me. You do have a tendency to go and just like give stuff the old heck and here. Yeah. Plus if you're just oot in a boot. She just unplugs that. the Wi Fi. <laughs> Oot and a boot, and you just got to do some little bit of killing. Yeah, well, I was just filling in the map, so no, that's you're fair. Probably, probably running around where I just was. Hmm, that's a good point. Minnie does love the turkeys. I I actually recently fed Minnie some turkeys because she is she's a very good kitty, even though she's bad. She's also very good. Because that's just the way it is. I mean, kitties just are good. It's true. Except for Liara. Except for Liara. And even then, eventually, I will consider Liara good again, but... Three days is not enough time. She's doing her best. Sure, but... She's not the one cleaning it up, so. Well, that's a that's that is fair. That is very fair. Uh, hey, how's the sleepy sleep situation? I'm sleeping. I'm doing it. Oh, okay. I must have jumped right out. Uh, okay. Ooh, that was a little delay for a second. All right. Let's see here. We're gonna night vision, we're gonna water breathe. Tuna! Not all of us are doing our best. Most of us are. I think all of us here are doing our best. Liara is sometimes doing her best. She's doing her best, she's trying. Yes, she is very trying to deal with sometimes. Oh my god. 
I'm the only one on Liara's side. I mean... Do you want me to bring you the, uh... The, the urine scented item next time? Oh no, I've I've done my share of that. And... <laughs> I'm sure. I will be again on her side at some point, but we just got news today that it is for sure just behavioral. Like we we've run all of the tests and it's just behavioral. So. No. On one hand, that's good because that means she's not sick. On the other hand, what the fuck, Liara? What is all of this down here? Where did this come from? It's I ate it. There's a lot of magma blocks down here. Do they generate this often? I didn't think they generated mm -hmm. this much. Uh, yeah, that might be considered ocean. If that's ocean at all. But yeah, oh yeah, they ge they generate all the heckin' time. Oh wow. Can confirm, I dig through them all the time as a mole. Wow. 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 That's why you were like, we're going to need magma blocks. I'm like, how many you want? I can go get you 80 million. Hey, our end portal is by a slime chunk, isn't it? I think so, yeah. Yeah, it is, because that's how I found it. Because I dug towards the slime noises. And yep. we have another portal to our end portal now, right? Uh, yes, we do. We do. So if you go through the nether okay. portal... And you, oh my god, there's so many, there's so many magma blocks. Uh, if you go through the, our main nether portal, and then when you come out, you go through the, the gated in section, uh, and then go down, just a little while on the left, you'll see the purple blocks indicating that you're on the way to the end portal. And that's it. I have to run past Mo's work of art. You do, it's true. Yes, so... Liara is an anxious kitty. Um, w would y'all like to tell that story, or, or would you like me? Oh, is she anxious? Yeah, we, well, we kind of sporadically ended up with another cat, and we thought they were sort of getting along, and um, no, no, not really, apparently. She's not a fan. She has told us that she is against this plan via peeing on things weekly or more than weekly and to the point of spending money on tests and all of the tests have come back good enough that they're pretty confident it's behavioral so now she's on anxiety meds so we'll see if that works I love the underwater music me too Alright, so Dolphin says there should be treasure like here-ish. Um, ooh. Is it for feeding the dolphin? It probably is. It sure is. Alright, let's see. Yeah, and I have friends who have had cats take like years. Like they've just tried reintroducing several times until it finally took, but... Like, I'm not giving up, it's just uh, the first couple rounds until we finally just isolated her, partially for what we thought was for her own sake, but partially to mitigate what she can pee on, uh, she ruined brand new items, so there was a little bit of grr arg grr at the beginning. It's not so bad now, because you pee on my clothes, I can wash my clothes, it's not the end of the world. Yeah, but... but when you pee on my new beanbag that I can't wash the insides of. Not so happy. She's doing her best, but her best was not that great for a little bit. It was frustrating as fuck. That one. Yeah. Sorry, y'all. Nah, I mean, I'm glad she's not sick. Like, in one hand, if it was something sick and easy to treat, that probably would have been, like, the a nice unicorn answer but I, I didn't think that that was gonna happen no matter what so I'll take not severely ill over you know some of the other possibilities just that... means that 
anxiety meds, and then probably if we get another one with the anxiety, another P incident with the anxiety meds, I'm probably going to reach out to a behaviorist and see what we can do. Like, because I'm sure there are things we're not doing, because I'm not, like, the know-all cat guru. I... I'm not going to say I didn't consider it like very briefly, but that was never an option. And actually, if we were going to do anything, um, we had taken in Lollipop, Chris, my husband's brother's cat, because at the time they had they had just moved back to Ohio and they had two dogs, two adults, a baby and a cat in an apartment because they're waiting on their house to be built. So our first consideration was and still will be if we get to that point seeing if once they get their house if they wanted their cat back like if if because it wasn't working between them if that would be a consideration because that that was probably the only real thought i had of giving one of them up is because i really don't want to but like if it really doesn't help her i don't want to make the rest of her life miserable kind of either yeah. Oh, yeah. we had two to start, and we have three now. So that's that's been a thing. We have that. We have feel away. We have her on a supplement. We right now we have her isolated to her own room with her own litter box that he's never even used, just to because we're trying to get it to stop, and then we'll start trying to reintroduce anything. But it's it's gonna be slow going. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, for like three days after she ruined my brand new bean bag, I was like, I want to give you away, but I don't want to give you away because I don't actually want to do that. But damn it, I'm mad at you. But we're long past that point, so. And I know better than to make decisions while I'm mad at a cat. No, she's my problem during the day. <laughs> yes, no, she's your problem. And by my problem, I mean she sleeps most of the time, so... Eh, what are you gonna do, right? I mean... She had a lot of things to do today. But you know what she did instead? She took a nap. She took a nap. I'm jealous of how much cats get to nap. Mm, yeah, it's pretty yeah. great, I gotta tell you. We think partially the litter box was an issue because the new cat has a habit that I've seen when I work from home of following her around, including following her around when she goes into the litter box. But the problem is, as I only work from home every other week, and so no one is around to see this otherwise, because they're both in their offices, you know, doing their, their work, you know, that pays the bills and pays for these cats' food. Doing um, office -y things. Right. And so I was noticing it, and so I was trying to stop him when I saw it, but heck only knows how often that happened that we didn't see it. And so around when this started, we started trying to separate them for a little bit after food. And that's when everything started going all sideways. So that's why we've isolated her to a room with her own litter box, because at least we know he's not bothering her like in person. Unfortunately, he still paws at the door. We're trying, we stop that when we hear it, but he doesn't believe in doors, so that is a harder fight than I would like. Some doors cats, aren't an insult. Yeah, some cats I know are just like, walk up to a door and, okay, it's closed and walk away. No, him, it's like, I must throw the tantrum to end all tantrums because I cannot go here and do you not understand. I mean, so, I don't believe in pants, so I, I sympathize. Yes, but you speak English, so I can have a discussion with you on when you need to wear pants if for some reason you were attending an event of mine that you really needed to wear pants for. Uh, like, you're making a lot of assumptions about my willingness to wear pants. Tell me that, I was going to say, or you can tell me you're not coming to the event because it requires pants, and that's also fine. But Elliot does not speak English, 
And thus doesn't listen to me when I tell him he can't go through that door. He does speak cheese, though. Oh boy, does he yeah. ever speak cheese. He makes the cutest faces for cheese. He do. And he reaches out his little paw and he's like, he gets that little please face and I'm just like, oh. oh. God, I love when they do the paw thing. Yes, he does the paw thing and it's flipping adorable. He's also like ridiculously tall for a cat. He's long. He's long boy. Oh, I love when they're long. Minnie does that too. Minnie, Minnie, like if you if you hold her up, she is she is stretched out. She is a long cat. So he'll be on the floor, and his paws will be on my desk, and I'm like, "Excuse me, sir, sir." And he's just we, like, "Brother, can you spare a chi?" We he's tr I've seen him open a knob door once, but he doesn't seem to know how he did it. So thankfully, that's not too bad. Um, he does definitely seem to be able to open, uh, Robert's closet door, which has, uh, caused some interesting issues because he got himself locked in it ah. the other night because he, it's one of those like sliding doors, but it doesn't have a bottom runner. It just has a top runner. So he pulled it forward and got past it and then couldn't figure out how to push out. Oh, little so buddy. Robert, Robert woke up and then, like, after waking up two or three times, closed his bedroom door because he's like, okay, I'm tired of being woken up. Whatever you're freaking out about, I'm done with it. And then the cries continued. Robert's like, what the heck? And found him in his closet. He's like, how did you get in the closet? What are you doing, Elliot? So yeah, he's he's not exactly the brightest long boy. But he is so cute, and oh he my knows it. Oh my god, he's so cute. Uh, Y'all will have to tell me what? when it's nighttime and sleepy sleeps, because I have night po I have night vision on, so I, have, I can hear colors. I was gonna say I'm under the world, so I don't know what time. I just it is. I just sat my bed down and tried to sleep. So can you sleep underwater? No, bed is obstructed. Also, there is a drowned nearby. So. Oh yeah, no, I, I saw that. <laughs> Even if it had worked, it wouldn't have worked. Elliot, during the weeks that Elena works from home, he just follows her around. Oh, for... like if she gets up. <sighs> oh, you got creepered. I got blowed up. He's my supervisor. She'll get up to, like, get something out of the kitchen. And he follows her out of that room. And then when she goes back in, she just has a supervisor. He'll follow her in and out of that room. Well, he's just wanting to make sure that she's doing her best. He's No, he's wanting to make sure that if I have any cheese, he gets some. Well, also, yes. That is making, would be, you would be your, doing your best if you were giving him cheese. Yeah, he's not wrong. I'm not sure giving him cheese is doing my best, but sure. We're, we're speaking on behalf of Elliot. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Y'all, I got, I got yeah. a buried treasure with a heart of the sea. Heart of the sea. A yar of the sea. A yar of the sea. Your slimes doing slimy things, but I don't see slimes doing slimy things. Dig to the towards the slimy noise. I 
I guess I could swim around and complete this map while I'm out, and I have a map. It's a treasure map, you know. It's a very good map. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you sleepwalk. I don't sleepwalk. I sleepwalk sometimes. Not often anymore, thank goodness. You sleep kung fu fight. Excuse you. I do not kung fu fight. Damn. Get wrecked, Lollipop. <laughs> Even though she doesn't realize she's I, wrecking I, you. I was gonna say, <laughs> I do get wrecked when she kung fu fights. Not that bad. Well, are you sure, though? It might be. It's not the ex who I almost broke his nose in the middle of the night. Oh, good gravy. Well, I, yeah, Lollipop, she's got a good point. I guess it's not that. <laughs> also because we sleep with our backs to each other a lot of nights. Oh, God. The lights just went out on me. Also because we have a king-size bed, so... It's such a big bed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Like, when you go other places to sleep, isn't it just terrible? Uh-huh. It's so bad, like... Well... Well, that and we have to sleep with uh, a fan on or have other kinds of ambient noises because of my CPAP. Oh, right, and right. we learned this when we went to go pick up Elliot because not only did we have to sleep in a crappy quality queen size bed, so it was small, it was lumpy, we had to sleep in that, but we had to sleep with my CPAP machine running without an air conditioning that we could really control. Like it would turn itself off. Oh, I hate oh, that. Time it turned itself off. Yeah. And as soon as it turned itself off, my breathing would wake everybody up. Oh, no. That's, that is... Which is, which is why we got me... One of the things I got for Christmas was a, um, a blindfold with um, a Bluetooth speaker built into it so that... When it's cold outside, I don't have to have a fan blowing on me for ambient noise. I can listen to 10 hours of um, Star Trek Voyager's engine room noises instead. Oh, engine room noises. Oh, that sounds so nice. It uh. is. It is really good. Uh, yeah, Sydney, when other Sydney comes to town, you'll have to tell us all stories about her sleepwalking. Because I want to hear them. I want to hear all the details of how she nearly kills people while sleepwalking. Because I know that's what this has to be. And other silly things that she does. Almost killing people and other funny stories to tell your children. Hey look, more, more experience orbs. Lollipop was here. Thankfully... My sleepwalking has gotten better since I was younger. When I was a teenager, it was bad enough that I woke up. I had apparently taken a shower in the middle of the night. Huh. Like, I don't I don't remember, but I woke up absolutely soaking wet. I, I had a friend do that while I was uh, over his place. He um, was standing the night over his place. He was asleep. He s sat up. I asked him if he was okay. He took a BB gun and swung it at me and then <laughs> went and took a shower with his clothes on. And then the shower woke him up, so he screamed because he was in the shower with his clothes on and very confused. Huh. I have learned not to interact with people who are asleep anything -ing. Because I had an ex who had night terrors really badly. Oh, no. And I was sleeping next to him because we lived together. We slept together. And I woke up. I am i don't know how I woke up. But I woke up while he was in midair jumping onto all fours like over me. So like if you were like on your knees and arms on either side of me. And so I'm laying there trying to figure out. And he's had, like, bad ghost paranormal night terrors, so I never know what I'm talking, you know, what I'm working with here. And so I'm just like, X, X, please wake up. Please wake up. It's me. Like, because I'm just, I'm literally sitting here going, this is how I die. 
because he has a gun on his nightstand because he needed it for his job and he's completely out of it i'm just like oh god oh if I'm no because i'm no my normal re thankfully he finally like huh i'm like please get off me he like moved like half off me and i like scrambled away and he's like what's going on and i'm like i don't know but you're freaked out so <laughs> and when <laughs> and that freaks you out and it just becomes this vicious cycle right you're freaked out and I don't want to be murdered because you think I'm whatever you're seeing. <laughs> I would like to not die today, poor Fivor. But oh, Jesus, other Sydney. Or opposite of Jesus, other Sydney. Yeah, no, night terrors are no fun. Do not envy anyone who has to deal with them. I sleepwalk, but I don't get night terrors. I have nightmares, but not night terrors. I don't think I've ever seen you night uh, night night walk. <laughs> sleepwalk. <laughs> sleepwalk. I don't. I, like night walk. It's gotten better. It's gotten a lot better since I was younger. Look I more. very strongly theorize it's stress related. So, you know, my life with you is significantly <laughs> less stressful. Aww. Aww. I think she means. I think she's saying she loves you. Or whatever. <laughs> she's either saying that or she's just admitting that I'm not the biggest pain in the ass she's ever lived with. I mean. No, you're not my mother. <laughs> Damn. Ah. Damn. <laughs> And thank Jeebus for that. Oh, sleep paralysis. Ooh, yeah. See, I ooh, could not oh, do. Could not do. Paralysis is the worst. Could not do. What's the... Uh, oh, that's not too bad. Okay, I'll, I'll keep on going. Chris has dealt with that a couple times. Yeah, is my, is my bed when I've yelled, because that's finally what I've been able to do. Oh, I thought you were saying that I've had sleep paralysis before. I was no. like, fucking when? <laughs> no, you've dealt with me, like, hoarsely hollering, because that's all I've finally been able to do after I don't even know how long. So the only problem I've ever had sleeping is that sometimes my throat might close completely on me, and that's that's not a good good look to have. And then you're a crank-ass. I was such a crank-ass. Jesus, fuck, if that sleep study hadn't come back with a CPAP, I didn't know what I was going to do. Like, the human body, like, is just... The human body is designed like trash. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I love, I love like, the whole process of, like, eating and tasting food and actually sleeping. Even though, you know, if it were more efficient, we wouldn't need the sleep. But, like, just overall, like, 6 out of 10... Well, it, it's, it was just a weird thing for me, too, because, like, I was, like, I was working with you when this started. Like, it, it wasn't, like, a thing that I was living with. I was just, it became a thing all of a sudden. And then, like, you, the, that, that week that I came in, I was just like, I just haven't been to bed in a while, in a long, long while now. And I was a crank ass and I was doing my best not to be a crank ass to anyone at work because no one at work deserved that. No well, one like, deserved that, but well, like you know. I just, I, I don't know. Cause it was like, it was weird. Cause like, like just out of nowhere, like you were like, I haven't slept. I just, I just have not slept in days. And I was like, I was worried. And then you said you were going to go get the appointment with the, like to have the sleep study done. And I'm like, oh yeah, that yeah, because like Tom, Tom right. also sleeps with a CPAP. Yeah. So you know he's, uh, you know it's it is, yeah. He, he understands the plight. Oh, he really, really does. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I have sleep apnea on both sides of my family, so I was like, you're, 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 you're doing this. Like, if you had any hesitation, he didn't this time, but I was like, if you're going to have any hesitation, 
about doctors or something, you're doing this. I don't screw around with sleep apnea. Like, no. Yeah, no. Because once I realized Ooh, that that's this? likely what was going on, I started panic. Like, because I'll wake up in the middle of the night. It, it's guaranteed. So I would wake up and then I'd wake him up because I'd put my hand on him trying to tell if he was breathing or not. <laughs> so if he did get to sleep, he didn't get to sleep. So pretty much it just worked out better for everyone if I could, you know, sleep. <laughs> I mean, that's, yeah. And if I could be sure that you were breathing. That's the important part. Mm -hmm. Hey, are y'all in a place where you can sleep? Because I made a place. Yep. I'm mostly just trying to find my way back to the, to the uh, nether portal at this point. Hmm, nether portal. Because uh, I came out here for all of the slime I was looking for. I made a sleep spot. <laughs> I literally <laughs> pillared up with dirt and made a sleep spot. <laughs> hey, if it works, it works, right? Right. And... I really wish my brain could sleep better. I would appreciate that. Yeah, same. I just like, my brain has a really hard time shutting off. Yes. You know, because like five minutes after you lay down is that time to figure out what you're going to do with all those work projects, right? <sighs> or is that just me? Nope. No, that's not just you. I will probably be laying in bed and, then, you know, I'll get in bed at like 1030-ish. And start to wind down, and then, like, by maybe 11.30, I'll either come to a revelation, or I'll just, like, think about something work-related. Yep. Yep. Sleep room at the TVs is now made. So. I haven't decorated it. I will do that eventually, but it's at least made and lit. Is it lit AF? Uh, not that you can see, but yes. Time for me to bring back a whole bunch of crap from out here. Because if I work on the TVs anymore, I'll start from at least the stuff I've got out here. I'm not going to be working on Blackstone and Netherrack. Oh, no, 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 no. What? There's a, uh, there's a drowned over there with a trident that I really just don't want to deal with at the moment. Ah. No. Nope. That's fair. All right, we are going this way. All right, now straight on home, I guess. Before too long, I should be able to see the, uh, the, the dock, the fishing pier. Oh, yeah, you see, you can't sleep in, in the darkness. I, 
I can't sleep with like no sound whatsoever. Um, or I don't do well with it. So I don't have tinnitus, but I do hear that like sound of silence, that little bit of a tone. And um, we have the one, we have the Xbox in our bedroom that it's an original Xbox One. So it does have like the fan, it stays on standby. So it does like keep running but we also have the ceiling fan going too so the ceiling fan provides enough noise to where it doesn't like you know have that like that sound of silence yeah it can't be too quiet no but i have to it has to be really dark for me so stuff has to be off and i have to like i have like a pillow over my head to both drown out like non-white noise and to like make it dark yeah because i'm a pain in the butt and it has to be like a specific way i mean i don't think that's a pain in the butt it's just it's you know but for me well okay that's (laughs) fair fair (laughs) yep nope you're absolutely right i'm annoyed by it hey so i'm gonna make tom a birthday cake i'm gonna make him a virtue cake I love this idea. Oh, I should have done that help? already. Um, good. I'm just trying to find where we, where we keep our eggs. Found them. Dang! Why didn't I do that already? Now I feel dumb. Why? Been preoccupied. Well, I got a new treasure map, and I I meant to swap it and, into my offhand, but I just started swimming, and now I'm backtracking. And I'm down to my last potions of night vision and water breathing. Uh, what time of day is it? I can't tell. Lollipop, I think you're the you're the one with the best gauge here. It's very daylight. Oh, it's um, very daylight. Okay. Yeah, it's almost noon. Oh, okay, perfect. I was gonna say it's pigman o'clock, so that's all I know. Right. Oh, new girl. Okay, so because I'm older and because I'm actually older and like also much older in spirit, um, we watch the Golden Girls every night. And so that's that's what we watch when we go to bed. And every night when we go to sleep, the Golden Girls is on and... Um, Sabrina will usually fall asleep fairly quickly because she just she lays on me and then she's out. Um, and then I, you know, kind of nudge her to roll over. There we go. That's a. Um, and then I'll turn off the TV. But like we we always have the Golden Girls on for a while because she needs she needs like the background noise to help her sleep. So if it's not the Golden Girls, we might turn on a Harry Potter or something else like. Um, the Aristocats before it gets to like the really like loud scene. Um, but yeah. Strangely, I'm the opposite. I hate having noise. But what? On. Sydney like, eggs. Other what, than a fan. What kind of eggs, Sydney? Like cream eggs? Oh, we got cream eggs. And Reese eggs. Oh, yeah, we got those, too. I think they were just asking about Minecraft eggs, because that's what I was asking about, but... Oh. Oh, well, that's way less exciting than Reese eggs. Or sure. cream eggs. Damn it, I really want Costco to get the giant bag of Reese eggs back, and... Yeah, I'm sure give it another couple not. of weeks, they will. I mean, they might not, because it might change from year to year, but... And since I'm buying through Instacart, I can't, like, just go see. Because we're still on strict no no people. Wait, like, just eggs, eggs? Y'all are out of eggs? Like, re- like chicken eggs? God damn. Oh, they're in... Well, depending on where they are, they might be more in the storms than we are. Yeah, that... Well, yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's right, because uh, other or Sydney... Forget, we kind of... Other Sydney's out in Louisiana. Yeah, because 
we're kind of one of the only portions of the freaking place that's not not froze over. Yeah. Under siege. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. I keep so forgetting I heard about supplies that. Supplies were getting we're getting bad in some places. Yeah, I have a friend in Texas, so she was giving me like real time updates of like the worst of it. I'm I'm sure like Sydney's been getting updates from like between other Sydney and her family and everything else. Like Sydney's been getting a lot of updates about that because she's here with us now in Florida, where it's been in the 80s the last couple of weeks. Yeah, it's been. We're back to kind of summery. It's like still a little cool, so it's still like I guess our spring, but. I was actually warm the other day, so. What am I naming this cake? Am I naming it the Virtue Tom cake? A lie. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like that. A virtue lie? Virtue Tom lie? A virtue lie. I'll go with virtue lie. Yeah, like, I don't think people understand. Like, it's this is Florida. Like, snow is not a thing. Like, it just... There's no such thing as snow here. Which is one of the reasons, which is actually just about the primary driving reason why Lollipop lives here. Correct. Mm -hmm. It's the only reason we live here, because that's the only thing that would have gotten me to move across the country. Is no snow. Yes. I mean, you saw that wreck. Never again. No yeah. Way. Yeah, I did. I did. I want to I wanna live somewhere where they're going to understand if I say I'm not driving in snow. Yeah. The North will just laugh at you, but... <laughs> like, maybe up in the Panhandle, I think they get, like, flakes, but... Yeah, a little bit, and, like, as you get closer to, like, the Georgia and Alabama borders up that way, they do. Yeah. But like deep where we are, if we see snow, we're we're all screwed. Yeah, no. Like, like maybe because <gasps> our power grid isn't as bad, but I would say no! we'd be probably just as. Mo. Mo's here. She's got to go give her face the wishy wash. She'll be back. Um, we'd be just as screwed as Texas in certain ways because our infrastructure and our like stuff is not set up for it and people's stuff is not set up for it no no like i have a friend who she's gone back and forth on considering moving to colorado and she's been doing this for a few years but so she picks my brain about like you know winter and she was like do you guys put antifreeze in your cars and i'm like yes what else would you put in your car? She's like, oh, we just put water in it. And I'm like, eh, eh, eh. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it just, it gives me the heebie-jeebies. I, I understand that it works, but, eh. Yeah, eh. yeah, yeah. I'm like, that's how you get a broken car in anywhere not Florida. Yeah. Why do I hear a zombie zombie? Because he wants your brains. 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 Because it's that cow. Oh, dang. It's always the cows, you know. They're very, they're very unsuspecting. There's a zombie on your lawn. We don't want zombies on our lawn. That gets stuck in my head about once a week now. Thanks, Elena. I'm happy to have served in this capacity. I know you are. There's a pet in uh, World of Warcraft that you can have that's a sunflower that sings that song periodically. Really? 
Yeah. Uh-huh. That's amazing. And I have it, and it's great. Of course they you also have it. Have, they have a Plants vs. Zombies quest in World of Warcraft in the Plague Lands. Oh my god, that's hysterical. Like, is it official? Oh uh-huh. yeah, no, it's it's a thing. Huh. Uh-huh. They had to have, because the, the sound bite is actually zombies on your lawn. Like, the, the sunflower goes... Oh my god, that's... Sit there and, like, actually hum it. That's amazing so, and adorable. Like, that's, like, the one thing that would get me to play WoW. Like, doesn't... Isn't Plants vs. Zombies an Activision thing? Um... I thought it was EA. Yeah, it's EA. It's EA because we have, uh, we have all three Garden Warfare's. They must have. Uh, they must have had like a cross licensing thing. Put, yeah, or like put that in before Activision bought Blizzard or something. Oh, maybe. Things are good. They are not fishy tonight, Mo. They are not uh, fishy. Other than him being a little fish in the water and swimming around. That's um, that's the I'm extent of the up- fishiness. The TV inventory. Chris is making Tom a, a cake because it's his birthday. Even though and Tom's not here because wrestling. It's fine. The whole month is Feast of Tom, you told us. It's true. Uh, no, I'm not anti WoW. I just, I've never played it. So, like, I had other MMOs that I was into. So, like, WoW was just never one of them. Uh, and also- starting now is just, ugh, like, yeah. You're starting from scratch and you don't know what you're doing. I, it's, I can imagine it'd be a little bit overwhelming. Yeah, no. Yeah. If you were going to play now, that would literally be just a thing that we like. That'd be your stream. You, you, make, <laughs> you make whatever you're going to do and then you do that with us around so that we can help you figure out all the poor shit that they've done to the game. What monsters are nearby? The cow. No, it's not the cow. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. Oh, shit. You're fucking kidding me. Oh, Coco. Okay, okay. I'm falling asleep on the beach. Sleeping on the beach. Do, 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 do. Mmm. I like your sleeping on the beach song. Very similar to a lot of other songs he sings. Listen, he's got a SpongeBob reference. He's got a very unique musical style, and I appreciate it. SpongeBob is a musical style now. T I L. Oh my God. (laughs) Skyrim is fun. I just got very mad at it very early because it had a rough launch at parts. So, I'm plus I don't like I don't like how you can like accidentally be like head of a bajillion guilds. And I just need some more realism. I uh, I somehow own like three copies of Skyrim for the xbox so yeah i don't know how but you know doesn't that just sound like a me thing i was gonna say normally you own things by buying them but you seem more confused i didn't i i've never purchased skyrim interesting yeah i i realized i need to never touch skyrim again after i was Running around, dual wielding the Master Sword and Dante's Sword from the Devil May Cry series, and my companion was a chicken with Dovahkiin's armor on that had an obnoxious amount of uh, carrying capacity to it and nothing else, and it was adorable. And I was like, okay, I'm modding this entirely too much. And I haven't even gotten to the part where, you know, the dragons were Thomas the Tank Engine or Macho Man Randy Savage, so... Oh, yeah! Sparkle, duh. Um, I can't find this... I can't find this, uh... It's buried treasure. Since he's not here, did you check no. your butt? Uh... It's like he's... <laughs> it's like he's still Turn. here. 
No, you need to go forward one more than you are. No. Like... Like, into that one. Well, let me get this before these things get into me. <laughs> if they're like weird zombie viruses or whatever. Don't come home with any weird viruses. Thanks. I will do my best. We have enough of them. Ugh, yeah, that's true. I mean, I feel like I'm right on top of it, but like... This is what happened to me last time. Like, don't I look like I'm right on top of it? Now you are, but you haven't dug down that one, so oh. dig down now. All right. Hey, I found it. See? Dang. Ooh! I got a diamond. I got a new disc. That's oh my god! I got n I got multiple discs. Okay. Okay. All right, we we got to we got to put some things away. We got to sort some things out. All right, give me Give me full stacks of shit. All right, let's let's You're just You're away from home, right? Me? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I'll what? let you know when it's safe to be home. Is it not safe to be home? Why is it not safe to be home? Oh God, what's wrong with home? Because I'm listening to the song that shall not be played. Oh. So that it's not next in your jukebox. No, it's I'm a. Sure you're gonna want to put the discs in. It's fine. Like as long as we're talking over it and shit, it's fine. It's just that like that one particular night, we were all busy doing other stuff, so we weren't talking over it. So it sounded like we were just playing it. Uh huh. I'm still playing it so I can listen to it. The song that shall not be played. Yeah. The song that shall not be played. <laughs> hashtag fish, hashtag dun, content. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my god, we got two new discs. Yes! Dun, 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 dun. This is great. Dun, 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 dun. All right, so let's see. I need... Why I really cleared out this sand over here? Um, okay. Yeah, he said minimal fish content, and then he goes and turns himself into a fish. For I didn't. Content. I didn't turn myself into a fish. I just went swimmies. I went swimmies. It's different. What do fish do? Besides become poster children for my uh, giving you crap. They fuck in the water. That's what fish do. They lay their gross fish eggs. Aw, you can't see we the then cake eat. name. Wait, why? I, know, I was kind of sad about that. What, did it, did you it... should make another one and put it in his mailbox. Wait, why can't name. you see the cake name? It just doesn't pop up with that when you hover over it. Oh. Like, you know how most things have the names when you hover over them? It doesn't. I think it probably has to do with, like, the food aspect. Oh. Fish are friends and food. Probably American. And somewhere Andrew is losing his shit right now. P. Sherman, 42 Wallaby Way, Sydney. Alright, this map is filled out. I am coming home. Ah. Oh lord, there's stuff in here. Chris. <laughs> It's an elephant thing, it looks like. I think that might have been oh, sleepy one Andrew. of the things that was on there. Right? So cute. Yes, Bowser. 
Oh crap! The jukebox continued to play. Must stop. <laughs> did you? Did it start playing cat? Yes. Yes. Well, that's good. But I don't want it to go loop back into the song that shall not be played. Oh yeah, it'll be fine. Like I said, song. as as long as we're. I know, but. I know. Listen, it's like a rite of passage. Like, you know, you're you're not a you're not a real video game streamer until you've had one of your vods partially muted. It's kind of like when you're. It's like when you get your first IT job and you, you know, accidentally cut power to half of a wing of the school because you miswire the power button on a computer that you're working on. Hypothetically speaking, of course. That is the bridge to Triabithia. That is Triabithia. <laughs> Did I ever tell you about the time that I accidentally um, zeroed out the inventory of all of my uh, company that I worked for? Lol, no. Um, with because we were doing ED because I, I did EDI for them, right? Okay. And um, one of I was trying to um, streamline some of the um, stuff that we were doing with that. And, um, fucking VB <laughs> doesn't know the difference between a null and a zero, right? So, <laughs> um, I forget how I did it, but in the, uh, um, in the file that we generate to send out our inventory to our, um, to our vendors, I apparently did a null check somewhere or I set something to null in VB somewhere which VB was like you mean zero of course and fucking sent zeros to all of our stuff so there was a good morning where just none of our stuff was on any anybody's website did you website. mention that this was Black Friday ooh this wasn't Black Friday yeah it was you did this yeah you no. At ABS or a AS? I would have been fired if I had done that. No, it was. It was that morning. I remember that because I remember that's why they were as pissed as they were. I don't know. I remember it being like either Black Friday or Black Friday weekend. Pepperidge oh. Farm remembers. <laughs> I don't know. I swear I remember that, but. I'm uh, putting the sword matic to the test. I can, can see tell. that. I can't even push it in right now. Yeah, no, Sydney, I started working on computers as a hobby when I was a child and professionally at the age of 16. And why is none of this sorting? Well, some of that probably doesn't sort yet, but... Most of it should have, though. Fucking fat beats going on right now with the sort of panic. Right. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take my stuff upstairs. That's probably a better idea, honestly. Yeah, I'm going to go upstairs and put things in in the alternate route, which is much faster because it doesn't use the item elevator. You're an item elevator. Damn. I hope you don't mind that. I'm probably going to keep using the normal route because it's what I know. No, that's fine. That's you, you keep doing what you're doing. Oh, no. This is why I put a trap chest. Uh, okay, that's good. Now let's... Oh. All right, now let's put down some stuff. Hmm, ender chest, shulker. We're good there. Hmm. 
Okay, that won't go, but that's okay. That goes back in there. All right, I want to see how much of this, because I know when it gets backed up, like some things don't sort properly, but like there were several items that didn't sort. It's okay though, we'll, we'll figure it all out. Oh, it appears to be the sleepies. Yeah, cannot recommend working on computers. Although, I will say, Kohler asked me the other day about some stuff, and I, I gotta get back to him on like resources and shit. Um, who's not sleeping? Me. Oh. Because I'm a slowpoke. Okay. That's okay. I just don't want to get creepered out here. I'm sleeping. Chris is sleeping. Okay, there we go. Good night, Mo. Sleep well. Oh, night, Mo. Have a good one. Get all the good sleepies. Um, hey, look what we have up here. Oh, uh, that's friendly. Yep. No, oh, these fucking guys. You can't go to Trader Tom's if you kill them. It's okay. We got milk, but I do want to kill them. Yeah, eat shit, motherfuckers. Yeah. Are you dead? Yeah, he's dead. No, it's not a bad career path. I just... I've been doing it too long. I want to do this for a living, which is unrealistic. The amount of redstone you do, that's still kind of working with computers. Just saying. That's because we can't escape our fate. I want to work with spreadsheets, which may or may not be realistic. I know you're not coming at me. Stole your string. <laughs> you can have it. And I don't want it. All right. Let's see. We got. Where's our spare discs? So we got a spare. And now we got two new ones. Ooh. Doom, 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 doom. I want to build a new gaming PC. I really do at this point. Can I help I mean, you build one, or help you find one, if you want to just go the pre-built route. I will, power. I will probably do a cyber power if I do a pre-built. It's the way to go, in my opinion. I've been keeping an eye on them, only because, like, the processor's starting to age, but... Aren't you due either do, this year or do. next? Yeah. Yeah, Emery, that's why that's why I'm probably going to go the the pre-built route because like it is hard to find um GPUs, but pre-builts they have those in stock typically. Okay, I 
I'm going to get off Minecraft because I need to go do my work do, thing. Do. But I'll probably stay on stream. Yay! I like when you're on stream. Even when I'm giving you grief? <laughs> I feel like he doesn't want to admit it. Hmm. <laughs> I think the only thing that I want to do, like, hardware-wise, like, at the moment, is I would just love an M.2 drive, but I don't really, I don't really need one at the moment. Elena well, needs Ooh. one, but I don't need one. Have, did you ever pick one out? No, I didn't. I don't know if that's correct, but I'm going to do it anyway. I mean, I, I think it's very much not correct, but... Whatever, it's there now. I suspect that top map is actually closer to that bottom right map, but... This one? I don't actually know. It looks like it could like come out into those rivers somewhere. I don't know. I'm just making stuff up. Ignore me. Ignore me. I mean, listen, I... No. This is great. So when are you going to make a, uh, a sea shanty about your, your birds? I don't know, but I really need to do that. Like, I... I haven't had the, uh... I haven't really had any, like, musical whatever in a while. So it's, it's, it's always hard for me to, to come up with that kind of stuff, you know what I mean? Like... It's one of those things like you're mm -hmm. you're either in the you're either in the zone for it or you're not. This is nice. Oh yeah, I need to drink the milk. You want to run an errand tomorrow this week, Chris? Bank? Uh-huh. Okay. I'll make it worth your while. Ooh. She's going to buy you snacks. So many snacks. If I, I don't really think I want him to eat this. I'm pretty sure I know where this is going. Oh my. It's it's school appropriate. Oh, I see. Yeah, I bet it I bet it doesn't have the name anymore cuz it's a place like a block now. Mhm. Mm yeah. Um, ooh, hey, we're getting candles in the next update, aren't we? I think so. I think so. So you would be able to put candles on the cake. Yes, I got mm -hmm. a project for you this weekend. Oh shit! Oh shit! Ooh! Did you notice the part in the lower right corner? Uh huh. Okay. I. I am being bribed. You are being the bribed. Right. So, um, Lena's solid state is full, so her World of Warcraft install is on her mechanical drive. God, it's awful. Uh, and it's slow as balls. And I was like, well, we might as well just get you an 
an NVMe drive at this point because, you know, it's, they're, it's kind of the new hotness, right? And they're not so, terribly expensive now. No. And so she is bribing me with installing it this weekend and going to the bank to deposit some cash with my own. So that's gonna. I, I'm installing two M.2 drives this weekend. Neat. I think I'm gonna activate this conduit. And do what with it? I don't know. Just put it out here, and make it. What the conduits you know. even do? I thought they did water breathing. They do. So wouldn't it be better at your boat? The SS Crescens. I mean, yeah, but also like. I just want to do it. See if I can do it. All right. I don't know anything about. Conduit, I mean, we so. have a bunch of Lux of the Sea or Lux of which we we'll call it of the seas now. So we have three of them. Heart of the seas. Yeah. I mean, I I've mean, got a not. conduit. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. Like, there's not we a. Can make another. I think is what he's trying to say. If you just want to make it for shits and giggles, then it doesn't matter. We can put one over by the other, other thing too. Okay. Ellie is being such a good boy on his tower. Oh, he's such a good boy. He just looked at me like, squint. Why did you turn on the light? When they have the squinty face of love, you like, when they make the squinty eyes at you, that's how you know it's love. Oh. Breathe. Yeah, I forgot that part. Oh, it's sleepy sleeps anyway. Again? Didn't we just sleep? Server, right? D you know, I say that every night. Yeah, <laughs> fair. Yeah, you're 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 out. Okay. I was like, I think I logged out, but then I uh get distracted by Amazon. So. Mmm. Amazon. Yep. Who's your good boy, the kid? No, he's such a good boy. He's such a good kitty. Wait, no, I don't want to get rid of that. I want to hang on to that. Okay. Let's see. Oh, bye, other Sydney. Get some sleepy sleeps. <laughs> thanks for stopping by and thanks for the follow. I love you. I miss you. We'll see you soon ish. All right, let's see. Um, I wonder if anybody's got like an exploded diagram. Oh, that's how you do it. Oh, I see. Set the point. Wait, does it have to be bricks? Can it just be regular prismarine? I mean, that looks like regular prismarine. Oh, okay, okay. That's the way it looks in Java. But, you know, we're just going to assume that we can do it in Bedrock. This is the longest you've ever been on a stream, and I love it. I love it so much. It gives me the fuzzies. The fuzzies that are warm. Seriously now. Now there's a fucking... Like, did you spawn in the water, you chucklehead? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they do. Ha <laughs> ha. How did I know what you were talking about? Because <sighs> you always know. All of us always know. All right. Okay. Ooh, look at you breaking the rules, Sydney. Sydney's over here living on the edge. Sydney's like, I ain't it's like final jeopardy you might be over, but I'm staying up. Yeah. 
Yes, Elliot, that's my spare work desk. Why are you sitting on those papers? Just putting screenshots of underwater ray tracing in, uh, in Discord, don't mind me. Did I, did I not do it right? Hey. The hell was that? You needing to know how to breathe? Was it? I didn't get hit with something? Checks work. That's not how any of this works. Did That's not how this works. Did someone do a? Oh so, yeah, Allie's not here because it's it's wrestling night and also Tom's birthday. I work <gasps> for a financial company, right? Are you okay? Whoa. Okay. It's working. It sounds like. Whoa, I activated a conduit. This is so cool. You need to clip that, your reaction to this conduit. Whoa, okay. It sounds like it's cool as heck. Yes. Do you hear it? It has a heartbeat. Yeah. Sounds like a heartbeat. And it like it's it's Whoa. Okay, anyway, I'm sorry. So you work for a financial services company. Right. So we get checks. This makes sense. I didn't know this before I started, but just a Courtesy box, oh. it does not matter. It, it's working, it sounds like. It's garbage, as far as we're concerned. So, someone is trying to get one of my coworkers to deposit a check for the box, even though the legal line doesn't match, because they just kind of want it to go through that way anyways. The, the financial advisor on this account wants it to do that way, and I'm like, that's not... Even if it does magically happen to go through, that's wrong, and you shouldn't do that and stop it. <laughs> it's not what checks are. That's not how checks work. Stop it. That no. <laughs> that's that's a bit how I feel right now. Like, please no. No. Why are you? <laughs> yeah, that's that's my opinion on the matter. Is no. No. I'm not, I'm only in this department on the weeks I'm in the office, so I will not be the one responding to that, so I will be interested to see tomorrow how uh, that is handled. Damn, what is the radius on this thing? It's something like between 32 and 96 blocks, the wiki says? Where are you? I'm over by the, uh, where the what's-his-faces were. Okay, now it's starting to wear off. Okay. Because, like, it's bright enough with this conduit power on to where I can see everything under the water crystal I clear, even with ray tracing turned on. You can, you can see sounds? Pretty much. Shining, shimmering, splendid. Yeah, a lot of people don't understand checks, I don't think. Not anymore, anyway. I mean, I get it. it. It's less the people who don't understand checks because I don't, I haven't written a check in years. So I don't 
fully speak Whoa. checks. It's more that the financial planner and one of my colleagues, not like my direct colleague, but someone who works for the same company I do, is going, yeah, we know it's wrong, but can you just deposit it for the wrong thing anyways? That's the part that I'm like, boy. Oh, you took it down. Yeah, I did. Wait, where did it go? I, I have it. Oh, okay. I was like, I silk touched it. Where did it go? God damn it. <laughs> you can blame Tom for that one. I didn't know that one before, oh, Tom. No, I know. I know. There that is. All right, I got to so figure... Where are you putting it now? I don't know. I, I'm thinking about maybe like building it underneath the the walkway. Let's see. Let me see what the X is over here. So the X over here. Oh, it's basically zero. Oh yeah, this starts at zero. So if I come out, let's come out to like. How far did you get? And um. My test results were inconclusive, I think, because I think once you come above water, you start to lose the power. Oh, yeah, it's it's only a... Yeah. Yeah, so what I was doing was inconclusive, I think. Okay. That's all right, though. I might build it under this... Uh, like, this intersection right here. Besides, it would provide a nice, pretty light. I don't know. What do you think? I'm good with that. Here. Have your, have your thingy back. Behind you. Oh. oh no, it's coming up. Thanks. Also come up for air. Thank you. <laughs> so, yeah, it's less the people who didn't know how to write the check in the first place, because, hello, been there. It's the people who know it's wrong and want to be like, eh, do it anyway. Like, no. It's not how this works. It's not how any of this works. It's not. It's really, really not. Ooh, it is the sleepy sleeps. Is it? Okay. Wait, are, did you run away to... Oh, you ran away to sleepy sleeps. Okay. I was sleepy sleeps as well. Wait, where are you? Oh. Alright, come on. Let's go turn this thing back on. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. <laughs> We're gonna go turn the. Th we're gonna go turn it back on. All right. I remove the top one and the bottom one. Are you watching? Mm -hmm. Whoa! <laughs> That's so cool. Uh, okay, I am... Are you still near it? Oh, no, you're you're coming with me. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Or do you want me to stay by it and tell you what the position is? No, well, I was thinking about it. Okay, so I'm... I'm at... 
128. 38? Mm-hmm. Dang. So I'm going to say 64. I'm going to say the four chunks. I'm going to call it four chunks. So like our actual simulation distance. And I bet if simulation distance were higher, it might be a little higher. But 64 is safe, I think. So I may move it out because it's at like, it's basically at like 36, 38, 39, 40, something like that. Oh, God. What? Oh, God. This room is so bright with this buff on. Oh, God. What room? <laughs> room to the nether portal. Oh, my God. Is it too bright? Oh, God. It might be the ray tracing, but oh, God. Did it hurt? It's, we turned off dark mode. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of like having it set up in the... Let me see. Oh, there it stopped. Yeah, because I'm above ground now. Here. Oh, yeah. Here, hold on. I wonder if the buff will stay with me over this way. Okay, I'm still doing it. So now I've got the buff. Brightness. Looks so cool, though. Okay, I'm over here by... Like, like I'm at the extreme edge or the extreme corner of, like, where our water starts by the barn and, and shit. Uh -huh. And, like... It's, like, it's still powered up over here. Holy shit. This is great. Wow. Oh, God. I just had an awful and a great idea. Yes. Whatever it is, yes. We need to get an, a, um, another beacon. Or another beacon, but just, just a beacon. Uh-huh. I think I know where we should set it up at. Where? I know exactly where we set it up at. In the Temple of Time? Uh huh. Yes! I am for it! This is a great idea. I love this plan. I'm happy to be a part of it. And also, <laughs> I am moving the beacon or the, the conduit. Hey, I'm conduiting. Go away. So we need to go fight the wither. I mean, we got we have the means. We got we have enough the means of production. Yeah, we got enough skulls to do it like five times. Yeah. The real question is, do we have a a place that we can put him into bedrock? The answer is yes. All right. Do we want to do that is the question. Sure, what the hell? Because that... All right, cool. We're, uh... We're going to add to our to-do list. Fight the wither. Spawning, fighting a wither in the end, then. Because <laughs> that's the only place in Bedrock to where we can reasonably get actually no we could probably do it in the nether if we really wanted to we, we can reasonably do what the the trick to fighting a wither um relatively hassle free is to get him stuck in bedrock um can it pass through walls um not it can't pass through bedrock it can blow up pretty much anything else, though. Including obsidian? I think so. Dang. Okay. I just remember that... Oh, I have two of your blocks. Oh, that's okay. Um, I just remember the last time I did this, I built something 
going up to the ceiling in uh, in the nether for it. Okay, I got conduit power all the way at the extreme end over here. Oh my god, this is great. All right, let's see how far I can get over here. Okay, I'm, I, I still have it. Still got it. Will it reach over here? Okay, so like coming over toward the farm, it stops. But we don't need it as much over there. Wow. So I guess it what it gives you like water breathing, night vision. Is that it? I think that's it, but that's okay. All right, so I am water breathing, night vision, haste. Oh, and haste. Oh. It allows you to sleep in a waterlogged bed in Bedrock Edition. No way! That's what the wiki says. What? That is just wild stuff. Shut the front door. Franklin Delano. I am making an underwater bedroom. I mean, check to make sure the wiki isn't lying to you. I mean, I believe... Th listen, I is it the Gamepedia wiki? It's Yes. Then I believe it. It does tell me bed is obstructed. It said waterlogged, so I'm not sure if... Oh, wait. Waterlogged might be slightly different than... Underwater. Waterlogged might be like this. There? Yeah, this works. Oh, okay. Well, ooh, I wonder... I wonder if we were to kill, like, water source blocks above it. Probably. We're still... We're... Oh my god, we still have conduit power out of the water because it's raining right now. Hey, where's my bed? Down there. Oh. I was going to test a theory. But the source blocks come back because they're... Because they're too close. The, well, you would have to... Hold on. You'd have to prevent them from coming back. So put the bed down somewhere. Oh, yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. Got this. So then I would have to do like. Well, no, you wouldn't. Ha you shouldn't have to do these. Well, this is. These are water source blocks, like here above the bed. Yeah, but can water flow up? Well, I guess it can. Yeah. So like. Well. Hey. Who was that? Wasn't me. I don't have a trident for once. Are you inside? You are inside. I'm inside, but it's it's not working. It's a being a pain in the the tookish. Hmm. I think we can get it working, but it's just being a pain in the tuckish. Yeah, and it's about that time anyway. We have a working conduit. I 
I may move it off to the side from where it is. Why don't you just build another one? Ah, no more conduit power. Ah. Okay, I'm getting out of the water then. Here's your bed. Oh, thanks. I threw it in the water. Oh, thanks. It's over there. Over where? Chris swiped it. Oh. Oh, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> he missed it throwing it at you. There you go. Throwing things under the water is not as easy as you think. Uh, it is not easy at all. All right, that finished. Let me see. I, I want to see real quick how much we got in here. Okay, so most of it made it. All right, I'm out. Um, so, oh my god, we made a conduit. And it works, and we can breathe underwater. And Lollipop can see sounds and hear colors. Eee! That was so fun. That was so fun. There's a clip. I'll go I'll go mess with it in a little bit. But, um, wow. I did lots of swimmies, and now we have more different swimmies. I guess with the, like, the way the conduit goes up also, because it's like a spherical range, so I could put the conduit lower instead of having to be, like, right on the thing. Maybe I could put it, like behind the barn down below i don't know something we'll figure it out um but yeah that was oh my god that's so cool and sword of attic seems to be working all right so far so good <sighs> fingers crossed so um yeah um don't forget to join us on friday for friday night happy hour where i will have the milkstein and sweet tea because Sure, why not? So bring your snack and or beverage of choice. Join us right here, same time, 7.30 Eastern till 11 p.m. Eastern. Um, we're going to be doing a lot more of this, and I'm going to be playing with conduits, and we might start looking at ways to uh, uh, spawn a wither. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But um, until then, thank you all for watching, and uh, we will see you. Wait, let's see. Let me see if some anybody's streaming. Um, I wonder if Gene is streaming. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, she very well may could still be streamings. No, but fire is. Ooh, okay. I'm going to raid fire. We're going to do a raid tonight because we've never done that before. So let's... What the hell? Let's give it a shot and see what happens. Yeah, we're going... We're, we're totally going to do this. Um... Raid. That's true. Yes. Yes. All right, here we go. Here we go. We're going, we're going. <laughs>